So my mate just procrastinating making this video. Hey guys, so as you can probably tell from the title, level 9 Bowser, you will not defeat me! Super Sun! We're talking about procrastination. It's something that once you start, you can never stop. Like online shopping. See what I did there, see what I did there. Old video reference. I have a question for you. Do you remember your first time procrastinating? Because I do. It was either year 9 or year 10, I, I, I don't remember. Age isn't important here. And I was sitting down with my friends at lunch, stressing out about this Spanish homework or something that I was meant to be doing because I just didn't like Spanish. Now it's handy to know that since I was young, I've always been on top of homework. I've always done the homework the day it was set. I mean, probably because my parents were Asian and I probably had no choice. So here I am, panicking about this Spanish homework because I don't like Spanish, and then my friend comes out with, why don't you just do it tomorrow? At that point, I thought I had the best friends in the world, but they were probably saying that to get me to be quiet since I was complaining about the Spanish on like every two seconds. Blah blah blah. I hate Spanish. Oh, yeah. Blah blah blah. I don't want to do the Spanish homework. Yeah. Blah blah blah. Oh, Spanish! Oh my god, just do it tomorrow! Doing your homework tomorrow was a completely new world to me, and I still do it. Much to a very worse extent. Tomorrow turns into another tomorrow, into another tomorrow. It's just an ongoing vicious cycle. Procrastination is both a risk and an art because you can leave something to the very last possible minute and you can still get it done. If you procrastinate right. So let's talk about last weekend because last weekend is a prime example of this. So last week for me was reading week, which is basically the half term of university. Yeah, I'll say that. That sounds about right. And on my calendar, it said there was an assignment due for Sunday. Uh, now, it's important to note that university assignments take time. They're like school projects. But the Tasmanian Devil version of school projects. <laughs> It's also important to note that once you become a pro at procrastination, then your brain automatically switches off. That sort of folder in your brain that you have to do something, and it switches back on to the very last minute. Really, brain? You had one job. So yeah, I completely forgot about this assignment until the night before it was due. And did I do it then? No. I waited for the day it was due three hours before it was due. That's when I started to take it super seriously. You know that the person that I showed you at the start of the video? That wasn't just for some random funny gimmick. It's a metaphor for how my determination skyrocketed to the point where I felt like I was in one of those cartoon trances of English literature. Medieval English literature. So it felt like 9,000! But in reality, to an outsider, it probably looks a little something like. So, procrastination. Something that started off as something very innocent and then plummeted down to something that is probably going to end up being very detrimental to my university degree. Yay! So if you liked this video and you related to anything that I said, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and be sure, well, I say give a big thumbs up. What does it do? I guess it just boosts my non-existent self-esteem. So that's the reason. <laughs> and also be sure to subscribe if you like me and be sure to click the little bell button if you haven't already if you want to get notified when I post videos. And I'll see you guys later on. Peace out.